Welcome to Mama Said Food Channel. I am Bass. I am Mama's greatest helper. And today I'm going to show you how to make chicken quesadillas at home. So, first, you'll need, uh, I'm going to be making them in my George Foreman uh, machine here. You'll need your chicken and your ingredients. So, we'll just uh, go ahead and proceed. Let's go. Everything's hot and ready. Let's get it going. I'm going to spray on some butter spray. Get it nice and lubed up. Like so. I'm going to throw on a flour tortilla. And I'm putting on some moderate jack cheese. that on there generously all over like so try to get the edges so you make sure the edge is closed and so that being said I have my chicken here so I'm going to take some of the chicken here cut this chicken off of the bone myself That should be nice and meaty there. And you can put whatever you want on them. On mine, I'm having the chicken. I'm having a few black beans. Like so. And I want to do some corn. And I want to do some onions and peppers for flavor, good flavor, like so. So I'm going to give it some more cheese. That's going to help my flour tortilla stick. Okay, so we're going to take this, got that like so, and I'm going to close the George Foreman down. Hmm. Alexa, set timer for three minutes. Three minutes, starting now. So meanwhile, I have to get a, a pot holder to make sure I close the George Foreman down. So, for these three minutes, I'll just do a little clean up. Close up everything. Get it ready for my next quesadilla. Which will be a beef quesadilla that I'm going to be making. These are easy to make. I just made my, my ground beef first. Made my onions, my garlic. Pepper separately, which is here, like I showed you. I made my corn separately. And I made my black beans separately. Here I have my cheese. And so we're just waiting on time. And so for my next one, when I do the beef, I'm going to put in some thick and chunky salsa over it. <coughs> before I press it. That's looking pretty good there. I'm gonna clean up. I'll use these again in a little while. Alexa, how much time on timer? You have one minute and 10 seconds left on your three minute timer. Awesome, we have one minute and some seconds left and I will plate that up for you.
gonna be using some holy guacamole and it has the spicy uh, pico on top of it so that's ready to go see it's red on top has a pico on top then it has avocado on the bottom so I'll be topping that And so I'm gonna get our spatula as well. Hmm. So many to choose from. Ready for that. And I'm just waiting. Yeah, this is a nice apron as well. I got this for Father's Day uh, for my daughter and my son Kyrie Brooks. And uh, they got this from a friend of theirs. I would like to plug her, but I forgot the name of her company at this time. Alexa, stop. And so we'll open it. This is how I was looking. Take it out with this. Pop. And so I'm gonna close that back down to keep it hot for my next one, right? And so what I'll do, just to show you how he looks in the inside, it's hot. It's hot. Mm. It's a smaller knife, that knife is too big. There you go. So now, it's cutting pretty good. I'm liking it. Show you finished product in just a second. The guac. I love to cook, man. I probably wonder, like, my dude always showing his food. I love to cook, and I think that um, me and my wife is a good husband-wife team for any television show. They need to have more black um, cooks like myself cooking, making delicious foods like this. My food doesn't just look good. It tastes good, too. I'll leave that. So, here you have it. This is the chicken quesadilla with the guac, the picket de gallo is on. Take a taste of this stuff, let me see. Mm. That is delicious. You guys make sure you come back, watch my channel, Mama said, like, subscribe, and share this video. See you later. Delicious. Wow. Mama!